Hello everyone and welcome back to Kid Cloud in Crazy Chase 2. Last time we were literally racing on the surface of the sun. And then in this part, we're gonna cool ourselves off in Waterworld. Hey, this is cool. Oh jeez. So in Waterworld, you gotta watch out for a whole bunch of bombs, uh, some rather angry looking fish, and um, what, was, what was his name, Kevin Costner? Yeah, Kevin Costner, Waterworld, yeah, that's right. Careful. In right no, world. I, I, I'm lying. I'm lying with that last one though. D don't worry. There's no sign signs of water world shenanigans in Kid Cloud. Oh. Hello. Oh my god. I, the first. I, was actually, I, I love the first fish, but I love the second fish. Like I was like, Dad. I was like, No. Yeah. Like one of them just doesn't care. Oh jeez. Yeah. And now yeah, we got these. Didn't care. We got these wall. We got these freaking wall. These wall cheap cheeps that just. Spew water guns at you and try to. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Did somebody call for a tidal wave? Uh... Gosh dang it, Naughty Joe. Oh, no. Oh, Naughty Joe, you reap what you sow. He was but, taken um... to the end of the world. Anyway, so Jay, hey, oh, you, you rhymed. You're a poet and you didn't know it. I Yeah, I just realized <laughs> the very last minute. Too late. But yeah, honestly, oh, no. Water World isn't, in itself isn't even that bad. Like, yeah, there's these giant fish that jump up and try to eat you, but. Honestly, so long as you're running and- Is that a sub? Oh, oh no, clown overboard! Yeah. Ah. Appar apparently so, like, how is that even possible? I don't know. Oh, what? <laughs> what, did you, what just happened? I don't know. Oh, nice. We're being spied on. Yay. Spied on from a, spied on from a submarine that, as far as we're concerned, is like two feet deep under the sea. Silly, what does that mean? Yatane? You did it! Yay. You did it! That's yep, that we did it! But we're not quite done with this level yet. Car says. No. Remember, every every planet is is two acts worth. Fine. So we must unfortunately deal with the water world once more. And yeah. you know what? Actually, thinking about it, I think I may have brought brought this up during our virtual boy um look at, but it still fucking shocks me that that got a that. There was a there was a movie adapt there was a game adaptation of Water World and it, they actually released it on the Virtual Boy. Loaded or floating, <laughs> I don't know. It looked like it. Anyways, I always love that little deep. It always was funny to me that like for scenes like this, like uh, kids kids 3D models suddenly turn into a 2D sprite, which makes me makes me wonder why don't they just stick to do a 2D sprite in general? Because like not to say yeah. that the game is completely yeah. ugly, it's just that it does seem a little inconsistent at points. Yeah, yeah I'm not, I'm not a big fan of the 3D models for these. I kind of liked the... <gasps> yeah, I liked... I agree uh -oh. with you there. Well, sh shark. So, what's Nice save. Here? Yeah, but, um, I mean, I understand why they wanted to go for... Oh. Wanted to use a 3D model for kid, mainly because this was, like, the dawn of the 3D platformer. Of course they wanted to freaking abuse it for what it's worth, but, it, but hey, at least some games actually have the decency to use 2D sprites when applicable. Thank you, Invincibility Frames. Oh gosh. <laughs> nice. Thank you, thank you, Invincibility Frames, from from allowing me to not be eaten by those giant fish. Yeah. Um. Oh, right. Okay. So something I was actually curious about asking. I know we brought up in the last part, but I thought since spoilers, this will be the last part of this little two-parter. Seemed an appropriate time to discuss it. What are the multiple endings like for this game? Um. Nothing. Oh, gosh. Ah, shit. Wait. What happened? We oh. got knocked off by the water jet. Yeah, I got walked off by the water gun. But, um, anyway, as far as the endings are concerned, well, I guess it wouldn't hurt to say it, because I'm sure some people have already are just watching this after watching my older thing with Becca. Basically, what the ending is determined on who, by who wins the race. Okay. Because, so, yes, Naughty Joe can win, can still win, despite the fact he's just, well, diving off just like that. So what determines if he wins the race or not? Pretty much the... Pretty much the very last level of the game. Mm. Oh, okay. Well, all more right, on that. This more on that when we get to that. But with that said, we're done with the water world. Yay! No, no more, fi no more feeling like fish food throughout the entire thing. Hooray! But of course, all all good things must come to an end. Cause notice that little star out in the distance. Looks like an yeah. ice planet, or is that a blue star? Yeah. Well, it's blue, definitely, and it does look rather chilled. I think you already know where I'm going with this. Ice physics. No, nope, we're going Ice with physics galore. Ah uh, uh, no. The chill star, also known as the the world's end. <laughs> yeah. More on that whenever we get to Kirby 64. But yeah, welcome to oh, the, I love welcome Kirby to the 64. 
Easy does it, boy. Goodness Ooh, gracious, this is this crazy. Music. How, how bad are the physics here, jo uh, James? Um, they're you. They're not the worst, but <sighs> yeah, in, in, the, in the heat of the moment, they can sometimes be your biggest enemy. Spikes. Oh yeah, there's also there's also ice spikes, and obviously you don't want to touch those. Yeah, uh, no. Goodness me. Also, oh yeah, also one thing about the uh, the little party balls that take you up. Do note that they do react to do react to your own physics. So Did I just if you don't, crack if you, the ice wall? yes. No, we just rammed into it. Some ice walls are thicker than others, so unfortunately mm -hmm. you can't get past them. Like these. The, that little yeah. jumpy noise. That's Bikes. that's actually that's actually really adorable. Oh, oh and here's a oh yeah, and here's a uh, fire world uh, callback. Oh good. And it just came and went. Not quite as hair raising as it was back back in the first game. Yeah. And now we got really... we got killer snowflakes. This world is Why? not a fun world. Merry Christmas, you to... son of a bitch! Oh god! Ah. Why would clowns try to pop no. you like this, where everything is trying to kill them? Ow! Oh, no. oh. Ow! Just the size of those goddamn stalactites—they could easily impale oh. poor kids. Oh! Ow! It almost did. There but it's sure. a good thing we're a clown. Oh! Just, no. It's shit like that. Why, well... Okay, in all, fa in all fairness, I did say earlier, I don't find this game quite as hard as the original. That said, it, it's still longer, so that still counts. And again, yeah. this game... What, again, what is this race over? Just, is it the fastest? It's a race on who gets to kiss honey, or who gets to get me kissed by honey. Hmm. Yep. It's all for the, it's all for the love of a ra of a rand uh, for the hottest clown in the galaxy. Ah. Look, spoilers, if you played the first game, you, she's really, really picky. Yes. Yeah. yeah. She is. Oh yeah. By the way, this is running. On, I, I don't. I want to say that this game is still mm -hmm. running under the assumption that you actually perfected the original game, where you actually do like get you. do get Honey's love. Okay, ow, ow. Because yeah. By the way, yeah. See, if you weren't there for that in the other game, there were like multiple endings, like endings that ranged from oh she's oh she does get captured by Naughty Joe and stays with Naughty Joe or no 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 that's not that's not what happens. Uh, what happens in the bad ending for Kid Con One is that. She gets blown up by a bomb. I mean, she's still rescued at the end of the day, but Kid Clown's punished for punished for not what? saving saving her scot free. Yeah. Yep. You need to scrub all the floors in high room. And she's she's just there being all hissy pissy that you let her let her get so with soot and stuff on her. For feet. once, I wish I dated a good guy that wasn't such a total loser. Ah! What a drag. Yep. And there's that. Oh, nice. There's that. There is. Uh, oh, you saved her, but she's in love with a clown from another kingdom. Yeah, who we never Prince... see again. What what was his name? Uh, Dudley Prince Dudley of... Clown of, from Clownistan. Dudley Clown. Yeah, that guy. And, um, yeah, finally. And then in the good uh, ending, you get all the kisses. Mm-hmm, you get all the hugs and kisses, which oh, are apparently too much for a kid because he's foaming at the mouth. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> kid Clown ain't so innocent anymore. Careful. Nope. <laughs> for the, from that day on, Kid Clown became a man clown. He's uh -oh. on the sword! Uh -oh. Ice ray! Not gonna lie, this isn't quite as impactful as when he was on a freaking jet ski in the original. Or excuse me, a snow ski. Oh, there yeah. he goes. <gasps> and let's see, let's see the poor, poor bastard's fate, just as soon as I can get one of these. There, there we go. go. Hmm. Off we go. Going. What happened to him? Let's see. Apparently nothing. Oh, oh that, that was a chip. Wouldn't have cool there was something. Thank you, honey. I mean, but yeah, just... Oh, boy. Okay, well, that said, we can all rest easy now. That was the last of the ice level. Oh, Thank goodness. Yeah, I can't Actually, think of a game that did ice physics right. Uh, Shantae did it all right. Like, mm. all you had to worry about is sliding off of those really high cliffs. The uh... Two, the two uh, N Nintendo 64 Zelda games weren't that bad with ice. Oh, and the Mario Galaxy. You could technically ski yeah, on that's... that slot. That oh, yeah, Mario I, doesn't I love have the it. shoes for it. So with that said, next up we're on the cloud planet. Okay. Okay. And, uh, oh, whoa. Oh, hey, crap. hey, 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 hey! The clouds obscure our vision. Yep. Not only oh, that. Joe. Hey, Joe. Hey, Joe. Well, Joe's having a fun, gay old time up in uh, up in the clouds. But um, yeah, like all things considered, this level ain't too bad, and I do like the theme to it. I guess you could say his head's really in the clouds. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I love that swimming motion. 
Yeah, it, it, you know what? I would totally, I would totally not be surprised if there was ever a day, maybe in the 2000 Nevers, when there's a mod where you're playing as Mario and D Dirty Joe is like Waluigi. Tell me it wouldn't be fitting. What is this? Er, d d he was er, trapped er, in a bubble. I said Angry Joe. Whoops. Angry Joe. Oh, no, Angry that's Joe. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I. I have a strong feeling he wouldn't give to. I don't think he would like this game all that well, much. Well, now I want a mod with Knuckle. Or, uh, now I not Knuckle. Not Knuckle Joe. That's a different Joe entirely. <laughs> Knuckle Joe. Now we're all There's too many okay. Joes in the world. Let's face okay, that. Okay. Okay. Now that you did that, Logan, I feel a lot better now. <laughs> okay, think about it. I'm surprised, I'm surprised the series has never never tried to eat a Joe's joke. <laughs> so I'm trying to think. So we have Knuckle Joe, Angry Joe, Naughty Joe. Uh oh, Force pissed. <laughs> oh goodness gracious. Uh oh. What other, what other, um, oh no, either that or that's Pit upset that we're using his voice actor again. Pit? I don't, I don't remember him having such, no, no, that's Phosphora. Oh yeah. But yeah, I'm trying yeah, the, to think of, oh, The hot-headed bitch who called, who called, who called, who called Palutena an old hag. Hey, his, oh, wait, he... wait, his voice actor was in this, wasn't he? Wasn't she? Yeah, yeah, he was, he voiced, she voiced Kid. Oh, hey, look, right, right, uh, right, right. it looks like the finale will be, we're, we're almost finally back to Clown Planet. Of course, and hmm. god damn, you know, looking at it from this angle, that looks really fucking creepy. It's so yeah. creepy. Uh, the I eye. Can, I can see you when you're asleep. It makes me think of, uh... You're not Santa it? Claus, leave us alone! It makes me think of, uh, what, what was it, Luna Moon from Baron the Big Blue House? <gasps> no, uh, no, 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 that looks yeah. nothing like Luna! Not with those lips I, and I, I the know nose. It's not, but, I know it's not, but it makes me think of Luna for some reason. That's See, that's the moon from Majora's Mask, silly cousin. Hi there, kitties! <laughs> no! No! Oh, it's my little cousin giving you trouble. Will you stop? <laughs> Why? Just because it sounds like my single voice? Logan, I'm going to kill you by the end of this video. If you don't shut up right now. I can see your dreams from here. I'm surprised you hate Logan's tingle voice too. I mean, Steve's is worse. Pull the bells. Yeah, his is worse, but I don't like tingle in general. Oh, you don't like tingle? That's a shame. Oh, you with a voice like this? What voice is that? I was trying to imitate like a feminine tingle. Oh, to be fair, there, that is that does exist. Her name is Pinkle. Look her up. Uh, yeah. Oh, right. That's, that's right. Tingle. That's right. That's right. I'm still debating if I should do a look out of that game. No. I would say there's no I would say there's no harm in doing it. A commentary would definitely be out of the question because that game is pretty much left up to chance. Logan, well, didn't we unless you unless you have a guide like that I did. With, uh, right. I, I restrained oh, it all. Wow. Oh, that's but it's really a game that quickly strange. becomes it's a game that quickly becomes too much of a hassle. Like it's it's not a no, it's not a typical Zelda game where you can plan everything. Like it's like oh well, you get into a fight here you should hire this bodyguard hire this one. It, it's I can, I can show off a for lack of a better, for be lack of a better word, the first Tingle game is is pretty much the de definition of a guide game. But now I am, but I am trying, but I am curious about the Balloon Trip of Love game. I heard that I heard that one's better. Like it doesn't rely on it doesn't rely on that like game of chance bullshit like the original game did. And in fact, I think they also treat it as like a point and click adventure game. It's like a dating sim. <laughs> kind of, sorta, of, yeah. Where your little words, which is also a. Loose parody of, um, hey, of The Wizard of Oz. Hey, Jordy, I just thought yeah. of an idea. What? Whoa. Um, if you join us for our Majora's Mask cosplay, you could voice Tingle's father and then tell Link how ashamed you are of Tingle. <laughs> what? Uh, but she doesn't have the man features for it. You can get a you can get mail from Tingle's father. Or, or actually, no, oh, not fail. You, you see his father. No, you just, you just, you give him a photo. You, yeah, you give him a photo and then he goes, how humiliating, this guy! He's my son! Doesn't he still give you, like, a heart container for- or, or a piece of heart for your truck for that? Yeah, he gives you a piece of heart, and if you already have the piece of heart from, say, like, the Deku King or another photo of Tingle, he gives you a silver rupee. Oh, jeez. That's Anyway, welcome to Clown World. So, yeah, it's time for the grand finale. <laughs> so, starting with- <laughs> Starting with stage 15, where- uh, Cloud Planet's definitely seen some very, very Hollywood aesthetics in the past time we've been out. So now James is having to focus again the suits, and he actually is, if you look close in the left, he actually is now racing against Naughty Joe. Well, I've always been racing Naughty Joe, it's just that, well, let's just, let's just be fair here. Like, Joe's just, Joe's just been standing around just plotting our eventual demise. Yeah. Easy, easy. Oh, By the way, God. No! Uh, 
Yeah. Oh yeah. By the um, way, don't mind that. Don't mind that weirdly weird looking golden Ganorga statue in the background. It does look like Ganorga. <laughs> yeah. Becca and I actually noticed that like when we were doing doing the commentary, we honestly can't unsee that. I was actually I, I was really thinking I was really thinking of the trolls, but I was like, why is there a troll statue in the clown world? Oh no! Sorry. But yeah, as far as this level's concerned, uh, there's really no major gimmicks as far as I'm concerned. It's, it's basically just take take what works best and, well, happened? getting... We, basically, oh. yeah, just give us the worst that, you, worst that humanity could possibly offer. So how hard is it to beat Joe? Uh -oh. Really? It's not that hard. And even then, you actually don't have to worry about racing him until the next level. Okay. Until then, you just gotta worry about more of his death traps. That is true. In the next level, we won't have to worry about the uh, suit cards anymore. Actually, no. You do still have. Well, actually, now that I think about it, we'll they, they about do it. still they they do still give you the suit. They still make you go through the get the suit cards for that for that portion. Now that being said, now that you mention it, I don't re I don't really get the context for doing so either. Like maybe you can't win the race without them, but that would be kind of weird. I never did try that. I'll have to do that next time I play through the game. Right. Because I was gonna say, like, it's not like you have to worry about losing any health or more. There are no more stages after that point. Right. Like, I. Hmm. Yeah, that's weird. But I know. Yeah. For the for the last level, they actually gave you all the suit spheres really early on in the level. It's like get hey, going. Go. Uh, you're just gonna stand there. Okay. Uh, easy one for me. All right. Now we have one left. One level left to go. And one and one level closer to finally get that spooch from Honey. Yahoo! God, look at how long long Gnorga's tongues are. Ugh. That's disgusting. Uh, it's like he's singing so opera. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, that movie was so stuff. That was movie was stupid. It was a weird time. A time when Don Bluth couldn't be trusted with making movies anymore. Oh gosh! Oh, I want there to be. I hope there's something good. Honestly, like thinking about it, like one like game that I could see making a pretty fun little anime movie is similar to the Little Nemo uh, anime movie, is uh, a Kid Clown anime movie. I would love to see that personally, but for it, in this day and age, Kid Clown is like the like the exact opposite of relevant. So I don't think I, I don't see that happening anytime soon. Now. Actually, now that I th now that I now we go back to anime movies, I'm wondering how produ how production's going for that one Dragon uh, Dragon's Lair movie. Oh yeah, that's gonna be fresh for like. Yeah, yeah, that did get funded, and um. Ah. ah! <laughs> Poor James. Damn it, physics! Don't screw with me oh, like that. Ah! I'm usually good about this. What happened Jump. to my skill? Jump, Oh gosh. You panicked. Fuck oh, you, Joe. Oh gosh. Oh goodness. <gasps> It's, I, I assure you, that it usually doesn't give me that much crap. Okay, and there you go. All of them take, yeah, we're like the very, like the third <laughs> of the entire like, level, we got I all the spears. And now that we go through this, through this bridge, now we race Joe. This is really like, oh nice. So really, all of, all of the entire game can be undermined in 40 seconds. Yep. Oh jeez. Come on, you can do it! This is Jump literally what we've been trying to do from the very beginning, and only now they're starting to make it an actual gameplay element. Which sucks, because, like, you can be but yes. so, oh, oh no. Uh, ah. oh, so they got, they oh, got bumped. But yeah, no, this nice. is what. Oh, this... Oh, oh, you can do it. But yeah, no, this is what the turn. Oh. Oh. Are you seriously gonna try to push us? Asshole. No, 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 no. But with that said. <gasps> Jesus Christ. Oh, yes, yes! Yeah! We win! That was actually intense. And now Ooh, for yeah. the good ending. Yeah, I'm the winner. Oh. Well, at least have the dignity of a winner. Get up. Okay, thank you. <laughs> you are the winner. Here's your medal. He's pretty much declaring us the winner. <laughs> no, you are now a hero, apparently. Ah. I guess so. And now it's time for the ultimate prize. Pucker up, Buttercup. <laughs> oh, he's been waiting for this long. Oh, God damn it, no! The car! What? What? What a fuck. You just smooched the car. Are you ah, kidding ah. me? Oh, ah. bad for that. Talk about road rage. 
And that's it. The end. That's the end. Wow. Click, hey, click. kid. Feeling okay there, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> I regret <laughs> this so much. Aw, that was cute. But on that note, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for our commentary on Kid Clown and Crazy Chase 2. Well, the reattempt anyway. And if you're wondering why there's no credits here, it's because I think they're way too devil damn long, way too devil damn boring. Probably for the best to skip them. Okay. But with that said, yeah, I it was actually I had a blast coming back to this, even though even though that we don't have Becca here, it's just I don't know what to say at this point. They, they, they I feel like that I feel like they can make. I feel like Kid Clown is something they could tap into. Like, what if they made a... I don't know, what if what if they gave Kid Clown the Wonder Boy treatment? Would be nice. I mean, Kemco is still a thing. Like, that's what shocks me the most. They're still a thing, and yet Hudson Soft closed their doors ages ago. It's like, Jeez. what the yeah. fuck does sense make? That mean, wow, Kemco has officially outlasted things like Visceral, who did, like, Dead Space. Like, they've outlasted mod modern companies, even. Jeez, what a time we live in. But with that said, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this revisit to Kid Clown 2. Honestly, that's pretty much it. Like, if we, if I was ever to revisit anything else Kid Clown related, it had to be, like, the spinoffs or, heck, the Game Boy Advance version, which does add a fair bit compared to the original. But I don't think we're going to really do that. But, yeah, hope you all enjoyed, and uh, see you next time. Toodaloo! Bye-bye.